everyone. Greetings from India. This is Nirbhay Chauhan from Make Love Guys Self Learning Tutorials. So in this tutorial, we will be solving a problem on the FreeCAD form. It's like how to create a bent surface using the FreeCAD. So the user has expected something like this to create a bent surface. So let's begin with it. It's a very simple approach. So we'll start with the Sketcher Workbench. We'll create a new sketch. Uh, let the plane be the front plane, exit plane. So from here, create a arc with endpoints and endpoint. So we'll select this region. So now let's set the radius of this arc from this constraint. Fix the radius. Let the radius be around 2000 mm. Now let's fix this point on this line on the region. Actually the FreeCAD is a bit technical software. It's not like just creating a simple 3D geometry. We can create a very very complex geometry in this. The condition is we should know the proper approach and we should be obeying the proper rules to make that geometry. Not like just simply creating a 3D objects and done. So you see we have set certain constraints here. The radius the horizontal distance between the two points so now close now we would like to have another sketch we will define the profile of it in the yz plane so you can see in this direction so we will create a new sketch in the yz plane okay so now this is a previous sketch here and now we are creating the yz plane so we will have this again that same arc so from the region only so we will make up to this something like this now we'll set the radius of this path. Let the radius be around 1500 mm. Now we will make this point attach this of uh, bottom line. Now set the distance between. No, it's up to you. You want to set the constraints or not? But for a betterment, we are setting the constraint to get the accurate and proper geometry. And later on, you can also change the, all these parameters. Now we have a green sketch here. It's fully constrained. Okay. So you can see we have this path and the sketch. Now we'll go to the part workbench. Here we have a tool named sweep. Utility to sweep. So we'll sketch the first sketch and pass into the sweep operation. Now we'll see the path. Select this line. Now done. And then the OK. So you see we have got the surface here. And it's totally a plain surface without any thickness. Now you can see how we can change the other parameters like we change the path. If you want to extend the path from here right now, so after we do, we'll change it to like 8000. Oh, we need to delete the radius just a minute. So let it be 8000, the length of the path. So we need to just decrease the radius something to this. So you can set the radius here around its it be 50 meters. So now we have see we have got the changes right after here. So you have your profile here. This white lines are the sketches. Which are not hidden that is why they are showing here you can simply hide them so this is a resultant sweep profile that you wanted to know so you see we created this initial profile then the path and then the sweep utility so you see it's very simple but a bit more technical technical in the sense it provides you more freedom uh, which you don't easily get in the software. You get a 3D geometry easily. But in this, there are certain operations which makes you easier to get more details and more uh, further operation that you can apply. Thanks for watching. This one is Bichuhan from Make Level Assessment Tutorials. Thank you.